It was announced that we had a new assistant bishop here, auxiliary bishop in Dallas. He is a priest of the Diocese of Dallas, has been here for over 34 years. He was trained and formed at the University of Dallas at our seminary here, the Holy Trinity Seminary. And it gives me great honor and great pleasure to introduce to you Father Monsignor Greg Kelly. And Good morning. When I got this phone call last week, the person on the other line said, hold for the apostolic delegate. I thought, oh boy. So uh, uh, Archbishop Vigano said that uh, Pope Francis had appointed me to be an auxiliary bishop of Dallas. And I've been so impressed with, uh, with Pope Francis, I thought I would do anything he asked me to do. And so um, I'm very grateful to the Pope for this appointment, and even more grateful for his ministry as our Holy Father. Both the substance and the style of that ministry has been so important to me personally, and I think important to uh, the Church throughout the world. And I've also been very grateful for the opportunity to work with my brother priests and deacons, and really to get to know them, um, and to help them in, in whatever way I can. I also realize that I'm no longer a young man. I'm not that old. but. Uh, <laughs> I want to grow old in whatever time the Lord gives me left, left in this ministry um, to express gratitude for the many gifts that God has given me. Uh, the intercession of Mary from which I benefit so much through my parents and to my own devotion. And also to prepare the way for those who come after me. And Pope Francis, um, and really I, I, I begin this ministry or receive this call at the very beginning of the year of mercy. And he constantly reminds us that the path to life on high in Christ Jesus passes through the periphery passes through going out to other people, our brothers and sisters who are suffering and hurting, uh, to whom we are called to be signs and instruments of God's mercy, uh, having received that mercy ourselves, and that's being highlighted in this year of mercies. And because uh, I, so I accept this new call to be an auxiliary bishop, I'm so pleased that it's here in Dallas, and I see that as a way of participating in that mission along with you and with all the people of the Diocese of Dallas. Thank you.